Hey Ross World, my money makes money. Being normal is being broke. So be abstract, be weird, be strange. Be that person, like my uncle, <laughs> we'll go somewhere to eat. And he like, oh, you get something to drink? No, nah, no, nah, I'm just gonna get some um, water. Then he'll get some lemon. Then he'll take the sugar packets on the table. I know, that is freaking cheap. He's making lemonade right there on the table. He told this one lady, he said, hey, go back there. Um, he said, give me some lemon. So she came back with two slices of lemon. You know, somebody just want lemon water. So he said, no, I love a lot of lemon. Can I get a whole lemon? And can you slice it in three sections? <laughs> so he's up there squeezing, 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 taking the either the natural sugar, cane sugar, or some sort of sweetener in order to make lemonade. Now, he wasn't just being frugal. He was being cheap because he's like, I don't got all that money. And that's how we have to be sometimes not worry, okay? Don't be weary about what other people think about what we're doing. Listen, you're over there, handle your business. Don't look at my table. I'm doing what I need to do, okay? So being normal is being broke because being normal, the average American, okay? The average American is broke. Seven out of 10 Americans is living paycheck to paycheck. Why is this? Because the new fad, okay, the, 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 the new thing, the new wave that's crossing America is look like you have money. Now, for some people, this has always been how they have been. But now it's almost in each age group where you have seniors, middle-aged people, people who go through their middle age crisis. Young people and those who just inside of their careers around 23 to 30. Listen, guys, you're going to live for a very, very long time. Now, unfortunately, some of us are going to meet our timely demise that we have no control over. But this is the thing. A lot of us are going to live to be 70 and 80 and 90 and who knows, even 100 maybe. If you're not prepared financially, there's no way you're going to survive. Unless you have some survival training, you went to the Alaskan Outback and you survive for months on end, you're going to catch your own food, make your own clothes, make your own shelter and survive the wilderness. Okay, that's neither here nor there. I am talking about the person who wants to live in a house, who wants to live in an apartment, who even probably wants to live in a trailer and move around or buy a Winnebago or buy a cruiser. It doesn't matter. Guess what you need? You need money. Even the people with corporations, even the people with business who own those particular products, like a person who build houses, he still needs money and assets to get other commodities that he need in order to survive for his life and for his family or her life and her family. So being normal is being broke. Don't be normal, okay? Be strange. When somebody like, you know what? You're really strange. I never really met anyone like you. Now, if somebody's telling you that because, you know, you're on the verge, you're on the line of being a criminal, that's not the type of stranger weird I'm talking about. I am talking about you are financially minded and you think at money a whole different way. You think about money a whole different way. How about this, though? In some aspects, when you get financially minded, you also get healthy. What I mean by healthy is your body, right? So if you stop drinking soda, if you stop drinking juice, and this is another thing people don't know. I'm, this is not really off topic. I'm, I'm kind of teetering here. Drinking juice, 100% non-concentrated juice is very, very unhealthy for you. Why is that? It's nothing but sugar. Now, in order to make one cup of orange juice, Okay, you can look this up. I don't care. One cup of orange juice, depending on how big or how small the oranges are, from three to six oranges. No one sits down to eat three to six oranges, okay? And when I mean by no one, I mean the majority of us, okay? Most of us may eat two oranges, but most, just one. So all that sugar, you're drinking, this thing, you're drinking three to six glasses of orange juice. Three to six glasses. All that sugar. So if you didn't drink orange juice, then you would just be drinking water and you save some money. Then you say, well, they said tap water and this, then I got to buy a filter. But yes, that's just one less thing you will have to buy. Here's another one. 
People think you need fruit. You really don't. A lot of the vitamins and minerals come from vegetables. Now we all know the most super food that everybody pumps up and that's kale. But the thing about it is a lot of us are lacking potassium and kale has lots of potassium. Now bananas have potassium but they also have sugar. So instead of getting a yellow banana, get a green banana, okay, before it loads all those carbs. That's what people talk about, carbs, sugar, but those green bananas, I think typically have no carbs, but it has all the potassium that you need. I'm off of it, okay, I'm off it. I'm just saying being strange. I'm a little weird, I'm a little quirky, I'm a little strange, and I'm okay with that, and you should be too. And by the way, don't forget Friday is the 1,000 dollar challenge update and i will be posting a video that day i want to see who failed and who succeeded because <laughs> you had quite a bit of time this is ross world where if you notice all of us are kind of weird on this channel all of us is kind of strange because first and foremost we probably were broke but we ain't broke no more dog we got a little bit of money in the bank i'm out